All students, teachers, and staff at pre-K through 12th grade schools in Illinois will have to wear masks regardless if they're vaccinated against COVID-19. Governor Pritzker's mandate comes as several top local pediatric doctors are concerned about infections among kids. WGN's Julian Cruz is live and will met with more on that. Hi, Julian. Hey, Micah, top pediatricians with a message for parents and keeping students safe. But it's more than just encouraging vaccinations for 12 to 16 year olds and their hesitant parents. Pediatricians are also focused on mental health. Last year, our children had to wrap their minds around staying home. This year, they have to learn how to return. Pediatric psychologist Dr. Gabrielle Roberts says parents need to remember that it's been a really tough time for kids and teens. Talk to your children, ask how they're feeling about going back to school, validate those feelings, talk about expectations. We've seen an 84% increase in COVID diagnoses in children and teens in the last week. Top pediatricians with the Chicagoland Children's Health Alliance with an urgent back to school message for parents. It is not a wise decision to take a wait and see approach with your child's health as we race against this highly contagious Delta variant. Pediatricians say it's rare, but children who contract COVID-19 or the more contagious Delta variant can develop potentially deadly multi-system inflammatory syndrome or other dangerous problems. All who are eligible for the vaccine need to step up and take it to protect themselves and others. Just 25% of those in the 12 to 16 age group are fully vaccinated, according to the latest data, the lowest number for any age group. All this with kids going back to school in the weeks ahead amidst a surging Delta variant. It's very transmissible, and the vaccine does a great job of preventing hospitalization and death. Which is why these pediatricians support the latest recommendations from the CDC and the American Academy of Pediatrics. All students K through 12, including teachers, staff, and visitors, should wear a mask indoors regardless of vaccination status. With prevention strategies in place, doctors say we protect those below the age of 12, not yet eligible for a COVID-19 vaccination. For vaccine eligible teens and adults, that means getting the shot. Pediatricians around the country continue to reiterate that younger children will pay the price for the cho choices of unvaccinated eligible adults. And doctors taking this opportunity once again to urge vaccine hesitant eligible adults to get vaccinated because it will keep everyone safe. And we'll met Julian Cruz, WGN News.